Hello and welcome to TVC Media News. We are staying with the decision of the Upper Legislative Chamber to set up an ad hoc committee to interrogate the details of the 30 trillion naira ways and means and other federal government intervention programs. The Senate gave the reassurance following the consideration of a report by its joint committee after an interface with the country's economic team. National Assembly Correspondent Tijiswa Adeoye reports. Chairman of the Senate's Committee on Banking, Insurance and other financial institutions presents the Joint Committee's report highlighting the current economic situation in the country. He also presents possible solutions. Indeed, the gravity of the situation demands collective commitment to implementing these recommendations and forging a path towards economic stability. The lawmakers acknowledge the current economic hardship that is prevalent in the country and they also admit that it has become increasingly difficult for many Nigerians to feed. But they are calling for more drastic measures that will immediately ease the sufferings of the people. It's those who are completely uninformed about monetary policies that buy and sell exchange rate under the tree that seem to be determining the real exchange rate. What the bank refers to as market means try to balance supply with demand. This is the policy that has crashed the Naira. The private sector players that are into agro-allied uh, uh, businesses should be allowed to import. The 30 trillion Naira Ways and Means Intervention Fund is still a matter of concern to the lawmakers as they are yet to get a comprehensive brief on details of how the money was spent. You cannot, I repeat, you cannot approve illegality. What they did was illegal. The Senate doesn't have the right. Let it be on record. Something in the interest of the nation. We are saying what you did at that time has put the nation in more mess economically. And therefore, because of the current economic situation, we have found ourselves that there is need for us to look at the details and to know whether they were rightly spent. Nobody in this chamber should suggest that we shouldn't look to anything that we feel is in the public interest. But let me say this very clearly. What Nigerians want today is food. What Nigerians want today is food. Adopting some of the committee's recommendations, the Senate resolved to investigate further through an other committee that will look into the details of the ways and means as well as other interventions by the federal government. Jesus, I deal with news. Abuja.